We are now going to see an upper multiple tooth isolation. We are going to place the clamp on the right upper first molar and we are going to isolate up to the canine. He has a few open contacts in the anterior and very tight contacts in the posterior. We have chosen an appropriate clamp. A W8A clamp usually goes very well with an upper molar. So we slide. Now we are going to place the clamp on the molar and okay. it's a little bit tight. We make sure that the clamp is well secure and he has all four points of contact. And again, we have the floss here for reasons of safety. We're going to slide the floss and take this out. And very gently, just take a nice deep breath. You will have a small bit of discomfort and that's it. And we place the rubber dam over the clamp. Okay. And as we slide it over the clamp, I'm going to make sure that we use it over and that's it. And now you can see he has a very tight contact here. We're going to worry about this a little while later. I'm going to secure the anterior tooth and let's get the frame organized. Okay. Are you okay? of loss. One more time. We're going to floss it down more than once because remember it's going to be a very tight contact. Okay, it's very good. Excellent. Through here again. Okay. Fine. Okay. We're going to evert the edges of the dam. You can see we have a very good isolation here and if necessary you can use additional clamps for the procedure.